The reason I wanted to be a befriender um, was when I was younger, I had a, a similar role um, model, and she was fab, you know, she helped me out with a lot of things through school, um, and I kind of just wanted to give that back to someone else and uh, kind of be part of that, helping someone kind of get through struggles in life, um, and also kind of to help my career um, as well. Um, one of the barriers, I think, was seeing the training and having a look at it and I thought, oh God, all these kind of people and it was a big group um, and I always remember kind of walking in and it was full of people, maybe like 12 people and I was like, oh, I don't know anybody and, and then they were getting you to do like all these crazy games and I was thinking to myself, oh, I don't want to be involved but actually once I was in and it was really fun and everyone was laughing and joking and I met some great people through it and so it actually turned out to be um, kind of really enjoyable and um, actually helped a lot throughout my befriending. Um, yeah, definitely. Um, a lot of it I look back and I had a lot of handouts and notes um, which I look back, I still to this day, I still have a wee flick through them just to remind myself. Um, but a lot of it was kind of, you were in the befriendees um, situation. So it, when you're out, you kind of think back to when you did the training and I was thinking to myself, oh, I remember sitting there and how that felt. Um, so that really kind of reflected and helped me um, kind of understand how the befriend, the befriendee was feeling um, in different situations. Um, yeah, um, I actually looked online and I looked at a few, but this one kind of related a lot to what I wanted to get out of it. So all I did kind of basically was dropped an email and then kind of came up, I mate mean, had an interview and then the training started um, and like I say, it just was a quick process and I got matched quite quickly um, and I got matched a, a great befriendee, you know, really similar, which was fab. Um, so yeah, it was actually really good. It was really easy, really supportive, had a lot of support. Anything I was unsure of, you could just pick up the phone. Um, so no, a lot of kind of support for it. And what was it? Um, great, you know, just seeing her kind of smile and laugh. And from that wee person you first met who was so quiet and wouldn't speak to you, kind of to this person comes out and tells you everything that's going on in their life and they're so confident and just giving them little goals to reach and seeing them reach that is, you know, it's a great feeling to know that you've kind of helped them reach that wee goal and, um, and like I say, just seeing them, just laughing and enjoying your time. Um, I think one of the things, having a support worker um, and the feedback you get back, because sometimes you leave it and you're like, oh, I don't know if that visit went so well and then you meet your support worker and they tell you, oh, she said this about you and she's saying this and she's all smiles and that just, you know, that just kind of is it for me, you know, getting that feedback. Uh, I'd say definitely to go for it. It's it's just amazing. Um, that couple hours out your week just to help someone else's life, um, and like say you know, just kind of their response to you is everything. Um, and it's helped me with my confidence. Um, so I've grown as a person as well as see this kind of your wee befriendy grow with you. Um, so yeah, definitely I'd go for it.